Hello, my name is Brandy, aka Pixelated Twix. If you're new here, welcome to my channel. And if you're an OG, welcome back. Happy Wednesday, guys. It's not Wednesday when you'll get this, but it is Wednesday when I'm recording this. And it is hump day, guys. I'm ready. I'm ready for my weekend. I'm ready for my vacation. But this is a short video, so let's get into it. Now, this is the second in the romance series of my favorite romance novels. Um, this book is called Nobody's Baby But Mine, and it is by the illustrious Susan Elizabeth Phillips. Now, we did another one of her novels uh, a couple weeks ago, so uh, we'll continue on with this one. Now, this is about Dr. Jane Darlington and her well, soon to be baby daddy, Cal Bonner. Now, what does that mean, Brandy? What are we talking about? Well, Jane Darlington is an aging physicist. Well, aging to her. You know, she's in her 30s and she's having baby baby fever. Um, and she's uh, ready to conceive. Uh, but there is a drawback. Um, she does have a potential, but she just broke up with him. Or he broke up with her. And he wasn't necessarily ideal for her because he was just as smart or almost as smart as she she is. And she doesn't want that. Why? Well, Jane grew up in, um, well, let's just say special circumstances. She was extremely smart for her age. And she was kind of singled out because of that by her uh, parents and her peers. And she just did, doesn't want that for her. Her baby um, so she's looking for a suitor or um, a sperm donor uh, but he needs to be uh, dumb <laughs> for lack of a better word or unintelligent yes let's use that that's that's better enter Kyle Bonner Cal Bonner guys I'm going to post them on the gallery however Cal's uh, last name will be spelled differently than it than it is in the book because for some reason Bonner on the gallery is listed as inappropriate. So you'll see his name spelled B-A-U-N-E-R. But that's neither here nor there. So she is on the couch crying her eyes out because, you know, she's her biological clock is ticking and she doesn't have a suitor um, there's no one in her inner circle of uh, co-workers that would fit the ideal and an unlikely neighbor friend or what have you just happens to uh, be sitting next to her and they're watching a football game well she's not really watching but her neighbor is and she looks up and sees Cal Bonner on her TV and he's on the sideline getting interviewed by a no, oh, a reporter Cal Bonner is the um, current quarterback of the Chicago Stars. Now, she thinks that he is the typical dumb jock because listen to him. He is tearing up the English language with those double negatives and those incomplete sentences like I do. Um, so she's like, oh my gosh, he's perfect. He's, he's muscular. He's hot. He's yummy. Yes, he is the one. So she's got to figure out how to get him to father her child um, and not be in her life at all. So the drama ensues. Now, a little bit about Cal Bonner. He is, again, the quarterback for the Chicago Stars at this point in the timeline. And he's also older. He's in his uh, upper 30s, but he tends to date women that are fresh out of um, high school, so to speak. He likes his women a little young, a little green behind the ears. Uh, yeah. And so anybody that's Jane Darlington's age is off limits. He's no, he, they're absolutely too old for him. Um, so she would definitely not be his type, but they get mixed, they get entangled anyways. Um, so that's a little bit of a sneak peek of nobody's baby but mine. I'm an avid reader and I definitely will suggest that you read these books. But if you don't have time and you, you know, are really busy, I really suggest that you 
uh, get these off of audible.com because they're, uh, the readers for these books are amazing. I love the voices. They're great. So that is all. I wanted to keep it really, really short because, well, we just don't have a lot of time, guys. We all live busy, busy lives. So, uh, but before I leave you, we got to take care of business. If you've made it this far and you're not a member of our family, why not? Hit that subscribe button and the notification bell so you'll know every time I upload. Also, do me a favor, like and share this video because, you know, YouTube needs to know that you like this type of content. Anyways, I love you guys and thanks for stopping by and until next time, ciao.